in junior high school and another drummer in the band actually had a recording custom. As soon as I hit the time, I was like, okay, this is it. You know, even in junior high school, I knew like it was something that I liked about it. When I saw the Dave Weckl instructional drum DVD and the way his tom the tone of his toms, and I just heard tone for days. And at, at that point, I was Yamaha <laughs> forever. I do a lot of different styles of music, whatever the situation. I can use the same kit on 10 different styles of songs, and it just works. I always want something that has body, that's beefy, but still has the high-end crack to it, and it still has the sensitivity where I can hear the snares without having to wail on it. I can really, you know, and these drums have it. They have everything that I need. <laughs> But what also I like about aluminum drums, they have a little extra twang on them. So sometimes I want that, you know, that kind of twang, and I can play towards the edge of the drum and get that little twang that I like to feel. I like to be able to have different parts of the drum that I can hit, and it doesn't sound the same. And this aluminum drum right here, it really allows me to express what I'm feeling at any given moment. You guys take what the majority of the drummers think and make that happen. I see the evolution of each time I come back and hear the drums of the finished product that you guys really took to heart what we all said, this would be cool if you did that, or this would be cool if you did that. And when I hit the drum, I feel that. I feel the heart and really the willingness to want your drummer, your artist to be happy.